Bottom of the 10th. Nancy Sinatra back in the mid 60s had Bryce Harper this weekend in mind. <laughs> She's saying these boots are made for walking. Are you ready, Boots? Start walking. Here's Petit continuing against Ben Zobrist. The pitch on the corner. Zobrist has a uh, six game RBI streak on the line. to drive himself in then. The Nationals now one out of 17 with runners in a scoring position 16 left the Cubs two for 13 they've stranded 10. Two, three innings. The bottom of the second is one you might want to watch over and over. It's the only time it's happened yeah. for either team. A slew of base runners here today. Bats in the right. Harper over to cut it off. Zobris is going to stop it first. And a leadoff single. Thinking about two bases, but Harper with his speed able to get over there and cut it off, and then his arm enough to shut down Zobris. What a good start for the Cubs here in the bottom of the tenth. And that changeup's been uh, up and down for Petit here today. He's made some really good pitches with it. He's made a couple of mistakes. He base it to uh, Hayward, and now Zobris picks on a high changeup. Ross is 0 for 1. He came in to catch in the seventh. Rendon ready to charge at third. They throw to first. Ross not showing bunt. If he doesn't catch it, the game might end right there. As Obers is a, a step or two shy of second base when Revere hauled that one in. His ball hung up. Off down at the end of the bat a little bit, so you knew it wasn't going to carry out of the ballpark. A game shaving catch by Ben Revere. One out, here's Russell. Jason Hamill is out on deck. Pitch taken for ball one. I need everybody today. Brown ball left field. First and second. That 
pitch elevated. Fatigue maybe starting to fatigue a little bit. So Hamill certainly capable of getting a base hit and driving in the, the winning run, but we got Baez on deck. Joe may have some fun here just to make sure he stays out of the double play. I was just going to ask you. This is typically a bunt spot for a pitcher, but when you're only trying to get one. Interesting to see how they play it. Fact that Petit, Petit's not a ground ball pitcher. Doesn't sink the ball, doesn't get a lot of outs on the ground. the start of last year. Ball strike three. Two outs. That is better as you would say than a double play. Not the worst <laughs> outcome. He shaves off the outside corner. Baez with a chance to be a hero. Played four one run games this year. You're saying he's going to hit a home run? Yeah. Let's go with that. It's their second extra inning ball game. I like that. Right center alley. Right there, that work. It's the game winning alley. The GWA. It's the ideal spot for one right there. Hang on the changeup. Ooh. Goodness. Two and one. Maybe a little cutter there at 85. Backed up on him. It's the John Daly of baseball swings right there. <laughs> 2 1 pitch fouled back 2 and 2. Wind has shifted a little bit now. It's blowing toward the left field foul pole. Kind of south, southeast. And Mike Maddox is going to walk out to the mound. And with the wind direction, if Baez had squared up that previous pitch. Might have been a yeah. Glenn Allen Hill shot. <laughs> I think Maddox wants to make sure these guys uh, know exactly what they're going to do here with this 2 2 pitch. And they had a discussion perhaps uh, before the series or how they wanted to pitch Baez, and maybe they didn't feel like they were following the plan. Winning run right 
there. Ben Zobrist at second. Russell has one job. That's to beat the force play at second if there is one. Off speed stuff up and he's getting away with it. Sometimes you, you, it's, it's bad enough, if that makes sense, that it's effective. It doesn't settle into that hitter's happy zone. I guarantee you this is not where he wanted to leave this pitch. Whoa. because now the runners will get a head start. So any hit to the outfield, ball game over. He's got a big hole on the right side. Murphy's playing right behind second base. There they go, the pitch. Fly ball to right. Harper is there. And we'll go to the 11. Cubs three, Nationals three. On your left, that's Ortho Bug Be Gone, a smart decision for season long control of all these outdoor bugs. On your right, well, that's the result of a really bad decision. Ortho Bug Be Gone, and be forgotten. What if we designed a stain for your deck that could stand up to weather like this, or this, or even this? If a stain can survive any amount of torture, is it still stain? Arbor Coat from Benjamin Moore. T-Mobile hit it out of the park. We doubled our LTE coverage to cover over 305 million Americans. And our new extended range LTE goes two times farther and works four times better in buildings than before. Switch to T-Mobile for major league coverage today. Mother's Day at Wrigley Field. Right-hander Justin Grimm will pitch. Follows Arietta, Cahill, and Warren. So Petit, Cahill, and Warren, three relief pitchers, all going at least two innings in this game. And uh, among the three, no runs allowed. So very effective work. These two bullpens. Yeah, really, really, you know, on a day where there's clearly uh, some members of those bullpens not available, these guys have stepped up and really pitched well. Justin Grimm with his turn now. I don't know if Joe would ask multiple innings out of him. Good thing we've got this box of Rizzo's up here in case we might need it. Man, we need a little sustenance. One and O on Daniel Murphy.
part of the uh, metamorphosis of, of Murphy is uh, pulling the ball more often too. Good down and away heater here. No, we try to go in. Swinging 3-0, and he's going to make it out. Jason Worth just took about as hard a practice swing as I've ever seen a guy take walking from the on deck circle. <laughs> Today bounced into a double play last time. Oh, and two. A pitch. Deep right, Hayward. Two down. Some fan down there just lighten up these Nationals players and just <laughs> making Chewbacca references to Worth. Ramos with a walk, two singles, two ground outs, an RBI and a run. Pirates uh, finished off the Cardinals, 10 to 5 the final, Cole over Waka. Three run a homer for Gregory Polanco. John Jaso also went deep. Mm. <laughs> Yellow hammer right there. Uh, so two out of three for the Pirates this weekend over St. Louis and five out of six overall. Russell to Rizzo to end the inning. Grimm with a 1, 2, 3, 11. On your left, that's Ortho Bug Be Gone, a smart decision for season long control of all these outdoor bugs. On your right, well, that's the result of a really bad decision. Ortho Bug Be Gone, and be forgotten. there was a paint that made you look at paint differently? What if it's built with better ingredients and even given superpowers? Since Benjamin Moore reinvented paint, is it still paint? Benjamin Moore, paint like no other. T-Mobile hit it out of the park. 
We doubled our LTE coverage to cover over 305 million Americans. And our new extended range LTE goes two times farther and works four times better in buildings than before. Switch to T-Mobile for major league coverage today. For the Nationals, it'll be Jonathan Papelbon's first appearance and only appearance of this series. I must go to the same gym you attend. Yeah, yeah. We, we pump iron together. The Bromeister. Ben Revere has moved to left. Michael Taylor now is in center. Jonathan Taylor since uh, game one of this series. Jonathan Papelbon is going to pitch in the bottom of the 11th. He's the closer for the Nationals. This is uh, 9 out of 11 in save opportunities. It's obviously not one of those. 0 2, 450 the ERA. Um, fastball velocity is down, but actually a little below average. Splitters his best pitch. He's going to try to get ahead, expand, and get you to chase that split finger pitch. Uh, he has not been getting the swings and misses so far this year. Preserve a tie. The old one. And one ball, one strike. For tenth on the all-time saves list, 358. Taylor gets into the action, first play, and he's got it for the out. Papelbon now 35 years of age. He's been drafted by the Red Sox back in 2003. Six-time All-Star. Get Petit an honorary uh, tourniquet today. Yeah, we got to get him in with a lead, but that, that was one terrific performance. Picked up Espinosa, the throw pulls Zimmerman off the bag. It'll be a hit for Hayward, his second in as many at bats. Winning run is on with one out. Very acrobatic play here by Espinosa. This ball somehow misses Papelbon. He goes a long way, spins and slings it over to first base. Would not have had him anyway. Brian hit one deep to the warning track. His last time up. Applebaum has not worked in four days. The last time he pitched was in Kansas City. It did not go well. He was a losing pitcher. Two thirds of an inning, an inning. He allowed five hits, three runs. Pitch to Bryant is on the outside corner. Applebaum. Got into it with Bryce Harper. And the dugout late uh, last year kind of summed up the Nationals' dysfunctional season. He sat out four games as a result of a team sanctioned suspension. And they made up and all as well. And Bryant pops it up foul out of play. He's got a little more giddy up on his fastball today. Been averaging just uh, right around 90 miles per hour. We've seen him 92, 93 here this afternoon. I guess that's what four days of rest will do for you.
deep right center. Taylor racing after it. He can't catch it. Hayward to third. He's going to be set. Relay throw to the plate. And he's out. Espinoza nailed him. We remain tied. Brian at second, two outs. Espinosa's got a very strong arm and it really pays off there. Michael Taylor, a good decision not to leave his feet. I think he was contemplating trying to make a diving play on that ball. Had he done it and not caught it, game over. Played it on a hop, got it into Espinosa. Good, strong throw home to get Hayward. It's a double for Bryant. They were thrown out eight to six to two, and Joe is going to ask about, I think, the, uh, the blocking of the yeah, plate. Yeah. Challenging the home plate rule. Yeah, and uh, you know, under the, uh, the letter of the law, I think he's right. We be. haven't seen this call. We haven't seen this since no. that first year. There really hasn't seen that. We haven't seen that call. You see, he sets up. Now nah, they're going to argue the throw took him there. Yeah. You know, he's going to be all right. Yep. The first replay we had it looked like he was Here's blocking, the, blocking the, 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 the base. Here's the another one. If Hayward slides feet first into home plate, he topples Ramos. We don't know if he hangs on to the ball or not. But we are seeing runners that the rule has worked. It, we have avoided collisions, but you are allowed to go right into home plate. Yes, as a base yes, runner. Yes, and you absolutely you can you can stay upright and hit the catcher. So the challenge denied. But the rule states is you can't go out of your way. To hit the right. catcher, but if the catcher's in the baseline, you know, he's, he's fair game. Dusty do here with Rizzo up in the base open. Zobrist on deck. And Bryant uh, had an issue with his shoe, so time called. We continue and a strike. Boy, a couple of huge defensive plays by the Nationals. In extra innings, the running grab by Revere in the tenth, and then the relay throw from Espinoza to Ramos here in the eleventh. Fouled by Anthony. Situation like this, Pavelman is likely to, to work out of the strike zone with his fastball and try to get swings and misses with a splitter. The 
The one two is low. Let's try two splitters in the sequence and Rizzo able to lay off both of them. That's one thing Riz has to remind himself that there's a base open here. Popped up. And caught by Ramos in front of the plate. Inning over. Cubs got oh so close to winning it. 3 3. It's time for a change. A new plan needs a new boss. It's time for something more surprising, more British than the Jaguar. We've already created a beast. Now it's time for a new animal with the same potent DNA, but even more ruthlessly efficient. Unleash the cat. Introducing the new generation of Jaguar. On your left, that's Ortho Bug Be Gone, a smart decision for season-long control of all these outdoor bugs. On your right, well, that's the result of a really bad decision. Ortho Bug Be Gone, and be forgotten. Justin Grimm just completed the uh, first one, two, three inning by a Cubs pitcher. In the 11th. Yeah, so you would think, that being the case, that it would be like an 8 to 7 ball game. There's been a lot of traffic. But not many runs. Three aside. Espinoza, a great throw. To get Jason Hayward. They needed to make today. two really good throws to get him, and they did. Fowler drifting over toward left center. Yeah, that's why you send him. If, if, you're, if you're Gary Jones, it's, it's a time to be aggressive. You got a chance to win a ball game. Taylor inside for ball one. Pitcher spot is now in the uh, six hole in the Nationals batting order. Bond is going to pitch the bottom of this inning, it appears. Quiet on the right field line, Travis Wood in the home bullpen. Two and one. Russell. For the second out. The reason we are in the twelfth defense. 
Yeah. Yes, ironic, right? Considering how bad the defense yeah. was early yeah, in the game for these two teams. For the most part, it's been kind of a sloppy game, but a couple outstanding plays. Here's the game saver. Well, Revere made that big catch. In left center. In there for a strike. Baez in on the grass at third. does this game have to go before we can call it the Mother's Day Marathon? Well, we're second and into center. We still have a ways to yeah. go. We gotta get at least 13 innings in before you can go there. Watch for Revere. He's gonna try to get into scoring position. Rendon steps in. Bryce Harper is on deck. According to baseball reference, and uh, special thanks to my buddy, stats guru Scott Snyder. He sent this note. Harper is the first major league player to have six plate appearances in a game and no at bats since Jimmy Fox did it in 1938. Double X. Pitch out. Threw an ankle high. Fox had six plate appearances and six walks. Well, I bumped into Phil Rogers up behind the booth here. He said he has counted 32 consecutive pitches without a swing from Harper. It's quite a list. One zero is outside. This is the road trip that won't end for the Nationals. A 10 gamer. They're five and four. And you know they're champing at the bit to get home. They'd like to do it with one win in this series. Cubs, meanwhile, trying to complete a perfect week. Make it seven consecutive victories. Strike zone three and oh. I bet Harper gets up with runners at first and second, they'll walk him again. Well, yeah, it, it, it'll be interesting that they walk the bases loaded with Grimm on the mound with that curveball in the dirt possibility. Little dice here proposition. We may see wood for Harper if it comes to that. It's come to that. It has. Here comes Chris Basio. See, add it up here. Harper has batted with one, two, three, four, five, 
Six, seven, eight, nine men on base, including this plate appearance. And they're going to put him on. And hasn't swung today and won't. Ryan Zimmerman, who's got a pretty good resume himself, has got to be over there going, man, what am I, chopped liver? This is something else. Six walks and a hit by pitch. As he chats with David Ross. Wouldn't you love to hear what he's saying? Base is loaded. Start walking. Da -da 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 dear 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 We had the list of 103, but due to time considerations, we move along. Three on, two down, and a 3-3 three, three tie. The pitch. Mm, yep, falling off that breaking ball a little bit. A little amped up. Neil Ramirez activated off the bereavement list. We've not seen him get loose today. Spencer Patton send, uh, sent back to uh, AAA Iowa. One and one. Warren has been used. Cahill. Wood has been up in the bullpen. Might not have Rondon or Strope available at all. Number 29 for Grimm. And it's a strike and a curve. And he's stuck with that pitch here in this at bat. One yeah, and two. And then I think it was last time it was with two sliders had Zimmerman. So they like spin against him. Had uh, three at bats off Arietta today, two off Cahill, one off Warren. Now he sees Grimm. <laughs> to third. Baez picks it up. <laughs> Out at first. Getting over. So the walk to Harper works out again. We go to the bottom of the 12th, still tied. On your left, that's Ortho Bug Be Gone, a smart decision for season-long control of all these outdoor bugs. On your right, well, that's the result of a really bad decision. Ortho Bug Be Gone, and be forgotten. What if we designed a stain for your deck that could stand up to weather like this, or this, or even this? If a stain can survive any amount of torture, is it still stained? 
Arbor coat from Benjamin Moore. By refinancing her mortgage, Jennifer Martinez was able to put extra money back into her home-based business, helping her do what she was destined to do, like a boss. Buy in. Quicken Loans. Home buy. Refi. Power. T-Mobile hit it out of the park. We doubled our LTE coverage to cover over 305 million Americans. And our new extended range LTE goes two times farther and works four times better in buildings than before. Switch to T-Mobile for major league coverage today. Happy Mother's Day message to my mom, Cindy. Thanks, mom, for being the mom that you've always been for me. I couldn't be here uh, without you. I also want to say thank you to my wife, the mother of my three children. Uh, thank you for being the mom that you are to our kids. And I uh, love you forever. Thanks. Good stuff from Ben Zobrist, and he will lead off the Cubs 12th. The crowd here today. A few have left, but not many, not many. Well, that's a nice Mother's Day tribute to your wife. It's her song playing yeah. for his walk-up music. Applebaum to Zobrist and almost hit it. Welcome to Mother's Night. We've almost reached six o'clock. Uh, you asked, when is it the Mother's Day Marathon? When yeah. the Padres ask the Nationals when they're going to be out of the visitors clubhouse that's when it's officially <laughs> waiting at the door with the mother's day the guys there with all the bags although they've got to fly from southern california so they won't be here till very late tonight swing and a miss one and two Mets lead the pods four two in the seventh in san diego Harvey and Andrew Kashner, the starters in that one. Kashner out after five. Both those guys having disappointing seasons so far. Harvey's punched out 10 today in six innings. Big surprise that it's a full count on Zobrist. Applebaum trying to work quickly, so Zobrist asked for time to reset, upset his rhythm a little bit. Feels like Papelbon is working more quickly than he used to. Yeah, he was painfully slow. See Kyle Schwarber having some fun at the ballpark. He walked him. That's a swing for so many guys. Third walk the Cubs have taken here today. They had this combo in the tenth. Zobra's done, nobody out. And they pitch out this time. Ross drove that ball to the warning track in left center, and Ben Revere from center. Really. Excellent running catch. Just 
Dude, rocking the wristbands. Making ball off the inside. Two and oh. To pull out the driver. Kick the two out of Ross. It's a strike. Blake Trinan playing catch in the Nationals bullpen as Papelbon's pitch count. Get to 25 with this delivery. Swing and a miss. Two and two. Challenge fastball. Over the heart of the plate. Thigh high. Maybe we'll get it by him. Send him here. Nobody out. Uh, I'm, I'm probably a little more concerned about the swing and miss than I am about the ground ball. Because is capable of stealing a bag. He takes off. Ground ball foul. And a nice jump, too. Goes again. Ross pulls it way foul. Fans on their feet. Zobris goes. Ross drives to right. Caught by Harper. He'll throw to first, but Zobris is back in plenty of time. Job by Zobris picking that ball up. He's a couple more steps towards second base. Harper might get him. Well, the other reason you're running there was Grimm's up next, scheduled next after Russell, and it's uh, Travis Wood on deck. like the kind of game that's going to end on a home run. You getting a feeling? Well, you know, I've had the feeling a few times that it <laughs> hasn't happened. Ball 
ball to second. Murphy Espinosa. Zimmerman inning over. To the 13th. 3 3. On your left, that's Ortho Bug Be Gone, a smart decision for season-long control of all these outdoor bugs. On your right, well, that's the result of a really bad decision. Ortho Bug Be Gone, and be forgotten. What if we designed a stain for your deck that could stand up to weather like this, or this, or even this? If a stain can survive any amount of torture, is it still stain? Arbor Coat from Benjamin Moore. T-Mobile hit it out of the park. We doubled our LTE coverage to cover over 305 million Americans. And our new extended range LTE goes two times farther and works four times better in buildings than before. Switch to T-Mobile for major league coverage today. Come on, baby, don't you want to go? Come on, baby, don't you want to go? Hey, welcome back, everybody. We are in the 13th, and there's been a lot of pitches made today. So it's, uh, flipped it up there 216 times, the Nationals 196. As we continue on, T. Wood will follow uh, Justin Grimm to the mound. You guys are hanging in there pretty good. Travis, 14 appearances, a 563 earned run average. Well, we're at the half marathon. 13 innings. Let me get one of those little decals and put it on the back of my car. Pitcher spot is next for the Nationals, and Chris Heisey has come out on deck. Last time up, Murphy swung at a 3 0 pitch and then flied to right. It's 2 0. Travis uh, up a lot in the bullpen today. Between all the bull bullpen work and what he does here in the game, he may be down tomorrow. On a hop played by Russell, and he gets Murphy. Russell's been busy, and he's been really good today. And had the potential to be kind of funky. A lot of times a ball like that will have some awkward spin. Cahill went three. Warren and Grimm each two innings. No runs allowed by the bullpen. Seven plus. Seven and a third now by the bullpen without allowing anything. I see two for six as a pinch hitter this year. Both hits home runs. Popped up. Ross. Has enough room. Two outs. Bring up.
Philip Ramos reached his first three times, has grounded out his last three times. Wilson Ramos had LASIK eye surgery uh, in spring training. You don't hear of too many guys doing it once games have no. started, do you? Where's the ball? Where's the ball? Rossi's saying, don't worry about it. At Deanna Navarro a couple years back, there was a pop up like that and he couldn't find it. He <laughs> just covered up. <laughs> I mean, you can't see it, you might as well, right? You're not going to catch it. Rolled in the left. This guy's having a day. Contracts we have to be uh, put on camera every uh, eight innings or so. We're about to break into the Rizzo's, my friend. <laughs> I'm still waiting for the uh, the text or the phone call. Hey, can you guys sing the 14th inning stretch? Hey, this would be the the rally box. <laughs> Take the Rizzo box, baby. We don't want to rally now. You got to wait. Turning them all into dust. Espinoza with three hits. Not saying this has been a long game, but he shaved in the seventh. One and one. Look out, folks. For those that just this guy's a magnet toppled and hit for the fourth time this weekend. I mean the ball just finds him. Run for uh, Ramos now. Joe Ross. Batter is Michael Taylor. Two on, two down. 
And the 0-1 on the corner, 0-2. Games like this really test the uh, the focus of the position players. You know, pitchers get cycled in and out. The position players have been out there all afternoon for all these pitches. Backdoor cutter. Throw to second, a little late. Ross picks his spots. Only with three pickoffs. Mm -hmm. A lot of times, you know, he'll communicate with an infielder, whether it's you know Rizzo at first, and that instance Opus at second. He'll call a high fastball on purpose, not a pitch out, but a pitch up. And he's got a pitcher out there running in Ross. Shallow center, but it's going to hold up for Fowler, and the inning is over. Bottom 13. 3 3. On your left, that's Ortho Bug Be Gone, a smart decision for season long control of all these outdoor bugs. On your right, well, that's the result of a really bad decision. Ortho bug be gone and be forgotten. What if there was a paint that made you look at paint differently? What if it's built with better ingredients and even given superpowers? Since Benjamin Moore reinvented paint, is it still paint? Benjamin Moore, paint like no other. T-Mobile hit it out of the park. We doubled our LTE coverage to cover over 305 million Americans. And our new extended range LTE goes two times farther and works four times better in buildings than before. Switch to T-Mobile for major league coverage today. WGN produced telecast of Cubs baseball will be Tuesday night, 7 o'clock Central. Padres and Cubs, game two of a three-game set. Battery here in the bottom of the 13th. Is a Lobatone behind the plate and on the mound. Right hander Blake Finan. This is a Trinan's third appearance in a row. Uh, not throw a lot of pitches in, the, in his previous two. Seven pitches two days ago, just four pitches yesterday. Hard thrower, power sinker. Get into the upper 90s. Chance to swing it for Travis. And he was working as a starting pitcher, was one of the best hitting pitchers in baseball. From Trinan is a strike, one and two. Remember, Trevor Cahill had to bat in the seventh to lead off the inning. He singled off Oliver Perez later. He and Dexter Fowler would score the tying runs. And Chris Bryant hit as Wood strikes out. Oh, Javier Baez.
Bobby had a chance to win it in the 10th. A couple on and two outs, he flew to right. challenges in a game like this is to, to force yourself to just you know stay in that one at bat one pitch at a time mindset I think a lot of times guys fall prey to the thinking I'm going to be a hero I'm going to take a big swing and get out of your game a little bit two and one One men left on base for the Nationals. Cubs with 13. Two and two. Good slider there from Trinan. Looks like Javi was cheating on a heater. for everybody. Well, <laughs> there were plenty of opportunities for these Cub hitters to do something heroic this afternoon, and Baez delivers. Somebody earlier said, I think a home run's going to win this game. <laughs> they just had that feeling. Cubs Man. sweep. Wow, what a win. Boy, all the strategizing. Great work by the bullpen. They're trying it after a, get, uh, throwing a dandy of a slider. Hangs one. And there you see the result. That's our Southwest Airlines. How far did it fly? 418 happy Mother's Day feet. Go to WGNTV.com slash contest for a chance to win round trip travel for two on Southwest Airlines. Hey, the Cubs didn't leave anybody on base that inning either. No, they did not. They have won seven in a row. They have won 24 of their first 30 games here in 2016. And they have not played many like this. Just their second extra inning ball game. And they lost last Sunday to the Braves, but they win today. Because of one big swing of the bat is with us. Congratulations, Javi. JD said uh, he thought a home run would, might win it, and he was right. <laughs> Can you hear us, Javi? Yeah, yeah. Hey, good. congratulations. Thank you, thank you. I'm just tired now. Yeah, Long uh, day, here, here, man. Here it comes. Just oh, be ready. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> Feel good. Yeah, I'll take that. Okay, we'll make it quick. Uh, what are you looking for in that at bat? You guys there? Yeah, we're here. Yeah, too. All right, nice. What are you looking for in that uh, at bat? Is something you can well, drive? Well, you know, obviously fastball, um, but you know they have been killing me with, with the slider. Um, you know, I've been I've been sitting on it um, in a few in a few ABs and um, I just can't I just can't get in the, in the right in the right spot and finally they took the first strike. We talked a lot about uh, uh, over the years about John Maley and how he. he you know, coaches you guys what to look for in certain counts against certain pitchers. Did you have a conversation with Maley before that at bat? Uh, no, nah, I mean, you have a pretty good idea on uh, Trinan's game plan. Yeah, he told me he threw um, 97 with a sink with a big sinker and and, and uh, the slider like a like a small cutter. And you know, after two strike, I just I just sit on it and, and he threw it to me. What's your favorite defensive position these days? All of them. Uh, yeah, pretty much, but I've been I've been playing really good at third, so might as well just stay there. Yeah, you've been really, really good. Thank Bobby, you, thank you. Go, go get uh, dried off and uh, enjoy the celebration. <laughs> yeah, enjoy with the, your enjoy oh, the yeah. dance party. Don't get any bubbles yeah, in you your eyes. Yeah, you know we will, for sure. Yeah. All, right, Javi, All right, thank you. Congratulations. Javier Baez with the big home run. Cubs win in 13. Woo, four hours and 54 minutes. And we're back with you Tuesday night on Channel 50. Game two of three.
as the Padres battle the Cubs 7 o'clock Central Time final score 13 Cubs four Nationals three Cubs baseball in high definition on WGN brought to you by Xfinity Xfinity X1 will change the way you experience TV the four 10th inning or the 14th inning however you look at it show is next. Chicago Cubs baseball has been brought to you by Southwest Airlines transparency low fares nothing to hide Ford America's best selling brand six years running inviting you to check out our fuel efficient lineup at your local Ford store or at local Ford stores .com. mattress firm where we want you to sleep happy guaranteed remember if it's over eight it's time to replace your Chicago area and Northwest Indiana Lexus dealer State Farm combine your car and home insurance with State Farm and start saving call your State Farm agent today or find one at statefarm.com Honda start something special with a great deal on a Honda now at your Honda dealer and by Budweiser not backing down since 1876 this buds for you